and Cindy in front of you. Okay? But the, I don't know how in control she is of those other people. Oh, I'm gonna talk with her later. Jenkins, I can show you one every time. It's all like, girl, just get out. Just get out, yeah, it's obvious. Like, I don't even try to hide it anymore. Mm. Like, she's just... Like, after the POV comes, she's like, that was a good try, Kevin. I'm just like, okay, sure. <laughs> like, fuck. Like, I'm just, I'm just over it. <laughs> Thanks, Jackie. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Your little meaning. We're just talking about you. We're fucking. Not <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. Get the same story. You're talking about me, or don't touch me with your feet, or you guys are doing something at the same time. No. We're That's doing disgusting. both. <laughs> That's disgusting. Uh, Jack, just uh, sit here. What did you say about me? We're just talking about this week. Okay. Dre, who? Real, who do you think is better for you, Kevin or Bruno? I think that's what it comes down to. <laughs> I don't like the both of you. Yes. <laughs> I think it's... I th no, real talk, give it to me, I love it. Okay, yeah. I'm I think it's out. very real. Yes. I think I, I don't like you. Mm -hmm. Not I think, sorry, I don't like you. Mm -hmm. And I don't like Bruno. That's honest. Fair enough. I do believe that if it's you and Bruno on the block, I'm going to vote with it, Bruno. And that's because... Okay, I'm not going to give you all my arguments because I don't know who you're going to speak to. But mm -hmm. that's my word. If it's you and Bruno on the block, I will vote with it, Bruno. I think I've been saying that since the beginning. William knows this. I can Dimitri knows this. I think everybody that I spoke with knows mm -hmm. that if it came between you and Bruno, I would evict him first. Maybe he doesn't know that, but that's another story. Mm -hmm. um, and I actually wanted to come. I'm hot. I actually wanted to come and talk to you guys both at the same time because I feel like in the past few days there's a lot of shit that has been going on. There's a lot of talk about Kevin said this about you and blah blah and blah mm -hmm. blah. And I legit don't care what has been said. Um, I think I've been very honest with William, and I don't think I've lied to him in this game. I have withheld information that I felt like he didn't need to know, mm -hmm. and I don't run back and tell every information that he tells me. If not, I think he would be in a worse position than he is right now. Mm -hmm. I think William in, is in a good position right now. And I do believe that if you are trying to convince him to use the veto on you for his game, you are putting him in a worse position than he already mm -hmm. is. Mm -hmm. And I believe that you know that as well. And I think that if you genuinely appreciate William... Mm -hmm. And you see this game, I do. I I really think that you know that he shouldn't use it. Well, I I told you if it's not good for your game, don't use it. Like, don't even entertain the idea. Honestly, only use it if it's good for your game. I would never. I wouldn't try to convince you. I wouldn't put you in a worse position. If like if if me if using the veto on me is bad for your game, I wouldn't convince you to do it. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't. And I'm not necessarily saying that it's bad for his game what I'm saying is that it would put him in a worse position than he already is mm -hmm. I feel like I've been trying very hard to make sure that I protect him and I feel like I don't want my efforts to just go to waste because he's gonna use the veto when I do believe in my capacities and I do believe that if it's you and Bruno I do think I can convince people that Bruno's a better pick I really do mm -hmm. and I'm actually honest and I told William the same thing and since the since like I don't like I, I don't like both of you I don't like you mm -hmm. so I and I'm telling you this so there's no reason no, for I me to lie that. on it of course you know so I just feel like I don't I don't not like you I, I don't understand you 
That's more it. I don't. I don't not like you. But I, I don't like you. I, I understand, <laughs> and I, I appreciate. <laughs> what? No, it's not, it's rude. not rude. It's right. You you telling me that it's like it's. Oh, I think people are just used to people sugarcoating and being like, oh yeah. no, blah blah. I don't. Just like when you pull me in the room with William and it's brutal and you and you're like, you guys, like, thank you for this move. We got to keep it safe, blah, blah. I'm just like, show me with actions. Mm -hmm. I don't do words. And that's why I don't get mad. I, I don't necessarily get mad if I hear, oh, I heard Kevin said this or Dree said this or whatever because mm -hmm. we're, in a, we're in a house where you're going to hear rumors. That's what happens. I have this conversation with you and then in two days it's going to be like, oh, yeah, and then she said that she loved me. You know, it, it words get twisted. For sure. So I'm trying to be as honest as possible and I am straight up and I said I do not like you. I feel like unfortunately William is going to try to protect you and I do think it's detrimental for his game and I do think that he's in a good position right now where he doesn't have to do it mm -hmm. um, and I told him as well if you want to use it use it but I do want to expose to him the perspective the different perspectives and the different scenarios just so that he's aware of what's going to happen. Yes. I don't necessarily think that I'm going to be in a worse position that I, like, I don't necessarily think that for my game, it's bad that he uses it. I don't. Yeah. And, I, and I feel like I told you the same thing. It's just like, I really think that it's not a good move for him. And out of both of us, I do believe that I'm more protecting him than the contrary. That I makes do. sense. And I wouldn't go, so you have a different perspective. If it's not good for your game, don't use it. I was only trying to provide, uh, provide a perspective where it is good for your game. But what's that's your what I see. Mm -hmm. my, pers I see. My, my perspective mm -hmm. is that the people that I was loyal to and my allies are all leaving. Netta, I told her everything and trusted her. Cindy, now if I come off the block, Bruno would go, right? Mm -hmm. So it's like these people, I've always never been going after you, but I've withheld information because I, those people were my people. Mm -hmm. And now that they're gone, I, I want to give you everything. Like all, a all my allies are gone. Holding information and lying, though. Mm -hmm. And do you feel like you've been? Yeah, I, ha I have lied to William at, at points for sure. Because, because these people were in because, your alliance. Because I, I cared more about those people. Yeah. Ahead of William for yeah. sure. But I've always I've always cared. Yeah. I've always tried to protect you. Every conversation in this group with Netta, I said, don't go after William. This is the difference, William. The difference is. William, and I kind of feel like he's in the middle and I don't want it to happen. And I've even told you, I'm. everybody knows, I'm not going to put you on the block and I'm not going to vote you out. You already know this. And I've even told William, mm -hmm. if you want to work with Kevin and, and you feel like it's better to be on that side, then do it. He knows that, that I'm not coming after him and he knows that I'm always going to be a vote for mm -hmm. him. I'm not trying to keep William on my side or whatever. It, it doesn't vibe. Like, like I don't mm -hmm. play that game like that. But I do feel like William's going to come to me and be like, Please don't put Kevin on the block, blah, 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 blah. But it's not going to be the same thing on the other side. And I was okay with that. I, and I was like, okay, it's fine, mm -hmm. whatever. I understand that maybe you guys have a special connection. It's fine. And I feel like as much as you guys are trying to protect each other, I, I feel like you're protecting him by withholding information or lying to him. And now that your people are gone, now you're like, okay, I'm going to turn to you and tell you everything when you could have built that relationship mm -hmm. before. But we did build that relationship. I didn't tell you everything because I was loyal to those people ahead of William. That, that you decide to evict. Because in this room, when Bruno was here and Cindy was here, I feel like you guys are trying a lot to put the blame on someone else. We collectively decided, decided to evict Netta. She was yes. in the blog. And we all, with our little minds, went in the little box and we, say, I, we said, I vote to evict Netta. Yes. If Netta you cared about her so much, I do feel like you would have made an effort, first of all, not to have her on the block. Not only that, but in that little block, I told you would have Cindy, said, I, told I don't want to evict her, and you would have voted to evict whoever else was left. But yeah. you didn't do that. I told, I told Cindy not to put Netta up. And then Netta was up, and then... And then I knew I, I voted with the majority. So then you're... So do, do you understand that yes. with your actions, the way that you've been playing this makes me hard, it makes it hard for other people to, um, like, it makes it hard for other people to um, trust and believe, when I say other people, I'm talking about me, obviously, mm -hmm. to believe or, or see where you're, you're coming from because you 
you are voting to evict your own. Mm -hmm. You're turning on each other. You go and you campaign against people that are in the middle. Mm -hmm. But then now that your people go, you're like, oh, okay, William, let me tell you everything. Blah, 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 blah. And that's the way you want to play this game, which is fine. But that's a part of the reason why I don't like you yes. or Bruno. Because I feel like you guys flip-flop. And then we're going to call out Jackie that flip-flops and goes one alliance to the other to the other mm -hmm. when you guys turn on each other and do flip-flop because your campaign this week was to put on black people in the middle that was that was the that's what i tried yes yeah yeah and then you turned on cindy whenever you could turn on cindy i i i didn't turn on Cindy. i, I pushed for ike to be the replacement nominee because i tried to protect cindy yeah i pushed to dylan for ike to be the replacement nominee because i tried to protect cindy mm -hmm. and i voted for cindy to stay I, t I tried to keep Cindy off the block. I pushed for her. I tried to keep Netta off the you block. you didn't give a different information to Jackie? You didn't think that you could reel Jackie in? Why was Jackie yes. so mad when you went into the room with, it was Kevin Bruno, it was you, Bruno, Aika, Dimitri, you went into the room and said, I don't know what, Jackie was pissed. She went into the room and spilled all of the tea. You guys were spilling tea on each other. Like, mm -hmm. what was that about? Because Since you pushed to keep Cindy. Because that's what, I, I felt like that was the only way I could stay off the block this week, is if Jackie went up instead of me. It was, it was like, I was, it was a hundred percent, I felt like I was going on a block and I so tried. So whenever your back is going to be on, up against the wall, don't you feel like throughout this game, whenever you, like, I'm not going to say you, but your alliance felt like you didn't know what to do. It was always one of your own. It was always one of your own that you were trying to push. Say, say that one more time. So whenever you feel like you're against the wall, your back is against the wall, or whenever you feel like the pressure that maybe it's going to be you, mm -hmm. you push for people that are on your side. Yes, I pushed for Jackie to go up, yes. But uh, the people I'd been with to start, I always, I always tried to protect Netta, Cindy, and Bruno. I always tried to protect those people. Mm -hmm. I was with Ike and Dimitri, too, and then we got distressed, and I was pushing to protect them, too. Mm -hmm. I was pushing to protect my so people. So now that you're on the blog, so you're not going to... Like, your campaign is not going to be against Bruno? It's going to be another campaign? No, right now I'm just campaigning for, the, for William to use the veto if it's a good move for his game. Mm -hmm. But it's not. I'm not pulling out dirty laundry on Bruno at all. Yeah. And if it's not, it's, it's fine. If it's not a good move for your game. I was trying to provide a perspective where I thought it was. So how, like, how, is, like, how do you feel that it's a good move mm. for William's game? Because I feel like I have the best personal relationship with William of anyone left, and I feel like I would just do anything for William for the remainder of this game, because all my people have gone home, mm -hmm. and we've had this personal connection, and the, and the trust has formed. Mm -hmm. I feel like I would, I would give anything for you in this game, and do anything to push you f as far to the final two as possible. So, if he doesn't use the veto, what happens? I, I really feel like Bruno has better connections to other people than myself. I really feel like I, I would go home, and William would lose a close friend that I would push for you to go as far as possible. Okay, so if you stay on the block, you feel like you don't have the ability or the, the capacity to campaign and keep yourself off the block, knowing I, that you need four votes and knowing that if ever you're on the block, William's gonna vote for you to stay and I'm gonna vote for you to stay, that's already mm -hmm. two. Knowing that I'm able to go talk to Aika and I, did, I didn't know, this is the first time I've felt that, now I know that you would have Bruno said myself, so I do feel a little bit better about the vote. I didn't, I didn't know that you were that, that was your position. So mm -hmm. now I do feel a little bit better, especially with your connection to Aika and yeah. Dimitri now, I do feel a little bit, but like before that I didn't know, I felt like I would only have maybe William's vote. Yeah. I love that, <laughs> thank you. I, I don't, no, I don't not like you, Dre, but I understand that you don't like me. I just don't want to, we're just... I that I don't like. <laughs> yeah. It's just that I, I, I don't know. I, I do really believe that I, I'm a straight shooter. I do think mm -hmm. that I tell it how it is, and I go with vibes in my gut, and I don't turn on the people that I'm working with. Mm -hmm. And when I see people doing that, it's just, I understand that that's how the game is played, apparently. Mm -hmm. I don't want to play like that. And I'm not going to play like that. Well, I'm not going to play like that for mm -hmm. now. And I just feel like looking at your guys, like your group, looking at the people that you were apparently working with, I feel like that's what you've done. I feel like 
you have turned on the people that you were working with very easily to make sure that your position was good. I feel like you have influenced certain things in this game to make sure that you were off the heat and off the radar. Mm -hmm. And I and I feel like you trying to trying to get the William to use the, the power veto is definitely understandable. I have mm -hmm. nothing against it. And I'm repeating it. If he uses it, I don't think it's like, I'm not doing this because it's going to be bad for me. I actually really believe it's going to be bad for William. I do believe he's going to get people that are going to be mad at him. Mm -hmm. And I do think that, um, I do think that Bruno would leave regardless. I, I don't want to say 100 because I would be lying, but I, mm -hmm. I really feel like he would be leaving regardless. And yeah, I don't know. I just, I guess I see things differently. Mm -hmm. I just see it differently. Do, do you believe me when I say that, like, if I stay, I would do anything for William in this no, game? No, I don't. You don't believe that? No. I think that right now you have no one else anyways. Mm -hmm. So it's very easy to say I would do any, anything for William because you don't have any other option. Mm -hmm. I don't feel like you have, I don't see that you have good connections with the rest of the house. And... So, so I, you see that I don't have good connections? I don't see that you have good connections with the rest of the, I don't, the house. I don't. And I see that William is your only choice. So I do believe that you would do it by choice. By, by, because you have no choice. Yeah. So I don't believe you when you say you would be willing to do everything in this, in this game. But you don't have to convince me. Mm -hmm. This is between you and William. Mm -hmm. It's just... Like, I, I understand the connections that you guys have. And William came to me and did ask, like, if ever I win, to not put you a blah, blah. And I did say that I would consider it, mm -hmm. even though you guys are my target. And even if you, well, Kevin and Bruno, like, the pair was my target. And yes. even if I don't like you guys, I still believe that Bruno is a better pick if he leaves. Gotcha. And I still pushed it. And I don't think anybody else can say that I pushed for you to go home. I really don't. Mm -hmm. Even if everyone was sitting here right now, like that includes Ika and Dimitri, I really have said since the beginning that I, I wanted him to go. And it's not because, like, I'm talking in this game, by the way, I'm not saying like I don't like you guys, I'm saying like in this game with the actions that you've done, I don't, yes. I, I'm sure Bruno is a great guy, I'm sure he is, but yes. I, I just don't necessarily like him in this game. I don't, I think I can see through him and I, and I don't like that. I don't like when people think I'm stupid. Gotcha. I hate it. So if you say that you're willing to do everything for William afterwards, I, it's fine. Whether the veto is used or not, I do feel like Bruno would leave, and I don't think it would put me in a worse position than however I am right now. I do think that William would be in a bad position, and I do think that next week you guys will be the new duo. And it's not going to be William and I. It's mm -hmm. going to be you guys if he uses the veto. So that would put a target on, on William, whereas, yes. whereas now... He doesn't really have a target. Gotcha. He doesn't necessarily need to... He doesn't necessarily need... To put a target on his back right now if he is laying low. Gotcha. But that's you know, that's that's just me and I and I My perspective was that if I stayed on the block with Bruno that I would be going home. But why that, do you think you would be going home? That's what I see because I think Dylan would want to keep Bruno, I think Jackie would want to keep Bruno, I think Karen would want to keep Bruno. I can Dimitri, I'm not sure. I had a really good real conversation with Ike and Dimitri this morning where they're like, yeah, we don't trust you, we're against you, but we don't know whether it's going to be Bruno or you. Mm -hmm. So I appreciated that from them. Yeah. That was good. I know that Karen doesn't like you, and unfortunately we can't really change that, mm -hmm. so I don't know about her, but I do think that you can work on the rest of the votes. And if that means that I have to campaign, I would. You... If you stay on the block this week, William's going to vote for you to stay, and I'm going to vote for you to stay. And if I do that, I just don't want to be on the block whenever you win HOH. It can, it can be anybody else. Mm -hmm. I just don't want it to be me. Absolutely. If you, if you guys vote for me to stay, like, and, and I do stay, of course, I wouldn't go after the people who saved me. Okay, I don't fully trust you on that, but that's going to be fine for now. <laughs> What? <laughs> Damn girl, ruthless. I love it though. I, you know why? Because one day I came to Kevin and was like, "Did you throw that competition?" And he said, "No." I, I would <laughs> and never, you did throw. Like, I, okay. I would never throw a competition. I tried my hardest, <laughs> and since that day, I was like, eh. And then we go on the spelling thing, and he spells risen. R I S S E N. 
the, f the first competition, me won veto. Dre, don't roll your eyes. Explain. The first, the first competition, me won like veto. Matt didn't really try that hard. Of oh, course. you did it? Of course, it was like seventy <laughs> percent. Oh, oh my stop. goodness, Dre. But highway, to, highway to spell. I tried. I got to the final round and tried. Yeah. To spell the best word possible. And then risen is spelled with two S. I'm, S's. Dre, I did not know that it was one S. Oh my goodness! I know you, you don't believe me. Seventeen years of I, Bible Bible camp. I know you don't believe me. Or Bible study. Wait, why, in the Bible, would, Jesus. Why would I get to the Why would I get to the final round if I was trying to throw it? Well, throwing is throwing. You don't have yeah. to throw in the beginning or at the end. Yeah. No. So I, you just throw whenever I you just, can throw. I wouldn't. Never. I, I, I know you won't. I know you won't believe me. No, so I, won't, I won't. Sorry. I'll just but stop talking. We'll see. I, sorry, I I won't believe. At least I'm telling you that I'm not. I know, and I appreciate that. I've never seen but there's there are there are. You know why? Because people don't like to be honest. They don't like people that are straight up. They want it to be like, listen, mm. like it's not that I don't like you, but and I'm not like that. So that's why you you've never seen that, and I'm not trying to be harsh or rude or whatever. Mm. I'm actually trying to just be as honest as possible. And if I leave this game because I was honest, then I'm gonna leave this game because I was honest. Mm -hmm. That's it. No, I, I appreciate that. So, I, you, I, I don't know if you understand that because you've been, like, with your actions and with your words, mm -hmm. it has been, like, contradictory or however you say that, that thing. Um, it's, it's hard for people to trust you afterwards. Yes. Therefore, I'm gonna have a hard time trusting you. Yes. Same thing with Cassandra, same thing with Gary, same thing with, ev with everyone. Yeah. The people that did trust me were Netta, Cindy, Bruno. Ike and Dimitri were on that list, and I was loyal to them, and then it, it fell apart. Yeah, and then you did send Netta. Yes, I did Cindy, vote against Netta. Uh, maybe not Cindy. I tried to get Ike to be the replacement nominee. I tried to save Cindy, and then I voted to save her, but I knew it was a sympathy vote. I, didn't, I knew it was going to be the one vote. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I just, I just feel like you can say whatever you want to William and to the rest of the house guests, but I just, I personally, Dre, appreciate honesty. And I tell that to Bruno as well. If you're going to lie, just don't don't say anything. Mm -hmm. If I'm going to ask a question and it's, it's a lie is going to come out of your mouth, don't say anything. Because mm -hmm. you know when you lie, you have a thing that happens with your nose. You do. Like this or something? It's a little thing. My name is... Dimitri. A little thing. It's a little thing that happens. Have, have you... Like, you've played this game very honestly, but have you worked lies in at all? If I was what? Have you, have you lied to people at all? It's a really good question. Yes. yes. I have omitted information. I have withheld information. Mm -hmm. And I have lied. Especially when I say things like, oh, I really like that person. <laughs> That's a big lie. <laughs> It's true. Yeah, she doesn't like anyone. <laughs> it's true. When I say I really like that person, just because I'm, I'm trying to make sure that that person doesn't put me on the block or not to be a target, whatever, it's mm -hmm. a lie. And it, it is hard because after I don't remember and I'm like, oh, I hate everybody. And then people are like, wait, didn't you say you like that person? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I'm not saying this game is played without lying. That's not what I'm saying. And I think I've, I've said it again and again. I am trying to be as honest as possible. Mm -hmm. If I come here, there's no point for me to say, I like you, Kevin. I don't, I don't see where that gets me. I don't understand what's the benefit of that. Mm -hmm. I don't see it. I do think, I see things differently. If I chill with Cassandra because I think she's fun, I don't see the problem. Like, I, I don't mm -hmm. see where the problem is. I think sending Emily home and not telling her that she was the target and not telling her that you or the votes were f against her mm -hmm. that's rootless me telling you i don't like you it's fine you're gonna live mm -hmm. making someone believe that they're gonna stay in a game because they have the vote and telling them i promise and you're good and blah blah and we're gonna i never this, told blah, blah. emily that she had my vote i'm not saying you i'm saying the people that you're working with isn't I that the same thing though Somewhat, yes, I understand, yeah. I never told them that she had my vote. I know, but that's the thing. If I, example, chill with someone that's a murderer, mm -hmm. you are going to think some type of way of me, right? We all do it. Just like when I chill with Cassandra, it's like, okay, Dre and Cassandra are best friends. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So, so I shouldn't have associated myself with them at all? 
With who? With the, the people. Like No, you made the choice that you made, but I feel like you make the choices that you want to make and then you make sure that that your name is always out of it. Like, if I say your group did that, it's like, yeah, my group did that, but I never did it. Yeah, but you voted Neda out. Yeah, I but did, I yeah. was listening to Aika. Aika's the one that blah, blah. Yeah, no, but I never... No, but, you know, it's like deflecting. No, I've, I've committed a lot of, of, of lies and bad things in this house, for sure. Yeah. And I'll, and I'll own that, absolutely. Yeah. So were you playing William or no? There was moments for sure, absolutely. Mm. But overall, William was someone I was never going to go after and always wanted to protect. Every time in that group conversation that we talked about targets, people would bring up you two guys. I said, not William, mm -hmm. not William. I said, Dre, fine, because we didn't have a relationship. Yeah. Honestly, I didn't, I didn't mind if you were my target. William, and I, I know that. I know yeah. when you had that conversation. William, I always defended. Yeah. I always said, keep him off the block. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. I withheld information. I don't know if that's plain, like, but I, I always kept you out of every conversation that my group had. I always felt like you were the friend I had on the other side of the house. And I knew you were looking after me there. And I knew that I was looking after you in my group. So cute. <laughs> oh, shut up, Dre. So cute. I love it. I love it. It's just beautiful. No, it's, it, it is. It's, <laughs> it's truly beautiful. <laughs> Anyways, well, that's so what, good. What's, the, what's your definition of, like, plain? Was I, was I plain, William? Like, I, I didn't tell him everything. No, it's more like, are you using him for something? Not, well. not at all. Like, it's just we, we actually have a good, genuine relationship. And now we've helped each other in the game. Mm -hmm. so I, I don't consider that plain, William, at all. If that's how you feel, then I respect how you feel mm -hmm. and how you, you see this game and your perspective. Um, and I just see a little differently, but thank you. Thank like <laughs> I don't not like you. I don't not like you. I just that's good for you. We're different, and I don't understand your humor, and I don't hang out with many Dre's in my real life. You know. I know. Mm -hmm. But I, yeah, I, I don't, don't, don't like you. So that means that I don't like you. Mm -hmm. That's understandable. But, so, and you don't like Bruno? In this game, no. In this game. Yeah, I feel like you guys just flip-flop, drop, pop and lock. <laughs> oh, Christ. <that's> <laughs> I do. But, like, outside this house, do you agree that it's different? Yes. 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 Okay. I do agree that outside of this house is different. I don't think I'm going to hold a grudge. I just feel like... I just feel like certain things are just overdone. I feel like it can be a little bit more creative. I feel like... I don't know. I, it's like everyone's playing the same way. It's just annoying. Like, your back's against the wall, so I'm just going to throw this person, and then I'm going to invent shit, and blah, blah, and I'm going to put a little dial and I'm going to put a little lie and blah, blah. And then it's already done. It has already been done. Mm -hmm. I don't like, I, I don't know. I just feel like it's already done. Going in there and trying to put dial down to Ika and Dimitri and, okay, let me not say that. The way I would have done it if I knew that there was a line between one side and the other, I would have been like, win HOH, put me on the block and I'll try to, work myself out of it. Mm -hmm. I'm I don't think I would be like, listen, I'm not the best pick. Maybe you should put William because blah 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 blah. I, I don't think I would. Maybe are, are you talking about the, the nominations? Anything. Any nomination whatever. Gotcha. Anything. All right, go ahead. But yeah, it's just where I'm coming from. No, I and I understand it better. From now. My perspective. I I think I just I don't know. I, I think I'm just different. Sorry, Jackie. Oh, good. I think I just play a little differently, and that's it. I think everyone is playing like this, kind of like the same way, or some people are just, I don't know. I think it's the same thing. Going after wanting for Aika to be on the block and pushing for her to be on the block, and that doesn't mm -hmm. work. Waiting last minute to be like, Aika, listen, like, why don't we get together and come after the, like, I don't know, it's overdone. It's already done, lying like that and 
whatever and then I don't know like reinvent yourself I'm not talking to you I'm just saying like do something else man do I don't know you're a fan of the show like people have already seen that do something out of the box like I don't know tell them yeah put me on the block and I'll come after you next week because I'll, I'll get off the block I don't know like maybe it's because I, I just see it differently mm-hmm. I just see it differently I don't yeah I don't I don't think I think not only because of my ego or my pride or whatever but I feel like if there was a clear divide and I see the divide and I see that I'm the target and I know that I'm going on the block I would go in there and be like you're gonna put me on the block what are you gonna do and then I'll just be straight up and I, I won't try shit, especially if I don't feel like I want to associate with the people that I want out. I wouldn't. But then yeah, again, it's but definitely different. Yeah, it's different. Yeah, it's very different. No, everything you said is pretty much bang on correct. And I can't argue against a, a lot of it. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not trying to be right. I'm not trying to convince you. You guys can still talk. I think this is going to be the last time that I say anything. Mm-hmm. And um, if ever the veto is not used, I am willing to campaign and make sure that Bruno leaves. I do think Bruno is... is I do think you're better for my game than Bruno. Mm-hmm. And if that means that I have to campaign for someone that I don't really like, then I will do it. And then you will stay. And, yeah. No, I appreciate it. That's it. And William, don't use the veto if it's not good for you, obviously. I, I, I said that at the start, too. Yeah, I said it. But anyways, I don't want to put... But I, I, feel, I, feel, I feel better now about the vote. I truly felt like if I was on the block versus Bruno that, like, I just see him with, with other people and I just really felt like I'm never going to survive. Well, Bruno Phil feels the same way. Mm-hmm. He feels like he, if he's on the block with you, he's the one that would go. So you guys both feel the same way right now. And... Yeah, you guys both feel the same way. I don't know. At the same time, I'm not holding the veto and I'm not trying to... I already told you this. I'm not trying to convince you. I'm not trying to influence you. I don't think that it's going to change a lot necessarily in my game. I just think that it's going to put people that don't need to be mad at you are going to be mad at you. You know, nothing. I'm just thinking. That's all I wanted to say. But, you know, at the end of the day, William is this nice guy. And, yeah, I feel like, anyways, that's it. That's my spiel. <laughs> that's my spiel. That's my little speech. Mm. If, if you're going to do whatever you want. Mm-hmm to William after then I mean for William for this game then that's really good for William I guess and he would do the same for you so that's even perfect